Spinal cord injury is a really interesting disease because, you know, a lot of other diseases people lose their mental faculties and they're not able to make decisions for themselves. But spinal cord injury is a really interesting one because for the most part, and not always, but for the most part people are able to um, make decisions for themselves. And what you want to do is give them the best tools for that. Well, at the Rick Hansen Institute, I'm working as a data science research assistant where I'm working on the project Trauma Severity Model. I work with uh, statistical tools such as SPSS and then perform uh, machine learning algorithms. This index will help clinicians in determining various things such as mortality, the length of stay of patients in the hospitals and how well the patient can recover from his injury and get back to his normal life. When we are talking about big data, we are talking about two challenges. One of them is large number of observation. Another challenge with big data is high dimensional data. And we wanted to predict mortality and which factor can affect on this. And we would like to use some technique that can handle this kind of problem. What we want is for people to have the most amount of information to make the best decisions in these really difficult times. You can collect lots of data and you need to do something with that data. And I guess doing that, she's taking those numbers and making them mean something that can hopefully make the lives of our patients better. By using Manekta expertise in big data, we develop a new scoring system to predict patient outcome much better. All time we had a co-op student from SFU and all time it was very successful to increase accuracy of prediction of outcome. To solve this kind of complicated problem, you need such expertise that big data program can give you, merging several techniques, several fields, and give you a new tools, a new way to solve your problem.